So black Americans are voting Democrat at a rate of 90%. Yes. And despite that, 38% of black children are living in poverty. Yes. 73% of black mothers are single mothers. Yes. 40% of government assistant cases are black Americans. Yes. Do you think that the Democratic Party is serving black Americans well? No, I don't. No, I don't. You agree? And you have to remember that it was the Republican Party that started. In the beginning, black people was for the Republicans. And, and, and what year, I don't remember when it got turned around, but right yes under johnson under johnson when he signed right. the welfare bill the new deal yes yeah. the new deal yeah thank you i know my history thank you i don't I what is your name well. alberta frederick black people voted republican in fact I want to say yes. in fact they was the ones who when lincoln was in office black people was all in that office until woodrow wilson Wilson's. the democrat took him out the racist that he was okay he took him out left one and he had to share the party that he was in share whatever office that he is in with a democrat white person okay that was woodrow rosen who did that and then the ones that was democrats and they were black they were the slave owners because almost four thousand blacks were slave owners and they treated the blacks work they pleaded treated their slaves worse than the white man. And at the same time, not only was the white man 10% of the white population that was slave owners, the one that was pushing up uh, right behind them with the most slaves was the Cherokee Indians. Okay, that's my family. And then the third, and the third ones was the black Amer Americans that was here, the, the, <laughs> that was the free men, the free slaves and the free men, the, ex, the former slaves and the uh, free men, they were the one who ran the Republican Party, okay, until Woodrow Wilson. And at the same time, like I said, the vast majority of your black uh, slave owners was the Democrats. Up, That's right. Yeah, what the Democrats. A lot of people don't realize that the, the, the KKK was an arm of the exactly. Democratic Party. They were the Democrats. And yeah. then at the same time, they became even more popular under LBJ. Right. And then at the same time, because he was a, a Ku Klux Klan. And, and I remember, because I was 13 years old when I went to that Civil Rights March, okay, with Martin Luther King, who was a Republican. That's right. Who was a Republican. All right. The thing is, is that um, most of your entertainers, black entertainers and stuff like that, they all voted Republican. And the reason why a lot of the Democrats get into office, because when blacks was able to vote, okay, when they were able to vote, and they knew, the, the Democrats knew that the, Repu the, the black people held Republican tickets. They took their tickets out of their hands and put two. Democrats in the box. Okay, that's how they got back into the office. The Democrats. Okay, that's how they rule the reign. Cause they took, they stuffed up the ballot box. Just like Al Gore, who was Ku Klux Klan, his father, were, when LBJ was signing the Civil Rights Bill, his father, the Grand Wizard, okay, was out there having a fit, doing a um, filibuster. Okay. I think she could teach a course. Yes, she can. Yeah. Yeah. Could I ask you a couple questions? Cause this, so uh, if I may. Um, I voted Democrat my whole life because I believed that they cared about gay people. I, I believe that they cared about black people, about brown people. I don't believe that anymore. I walked away from the Democratic Party. I created something called the Walk Away Campaign. Okay. You started it? I started it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you, have you heard of it? Yes! yes. yes. I, I heard it! Yes. Yes. And, and yes. all of folks, yes! yes. 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 So, so we made a movie called The Great Awakening, Breaking the Chains of the Democratic Party. It's made with the testimonials of 20 black Americans who have walked away. It's amazing. Why are 90% of black people still voting Democrat when the Democrats don't care? Because the Democrats made it seem like under uh, LBJ that they was becoming like uh, the Republican. Never mind, the Republican never gave you welfare. Right. He ne they never gave you welfare. And the black people said, oh, well, we needed welfare. No, you never did. Well, we was doing fine without it. That's right. I think so, too. I'm right. fine without it. But since when people know that, because even uh, Booker T. Washington, um, he talked about why he, he noticed that how, when he did the Tuskegee Institute thing, you had to make your own bed, okay? So when the rich people wanted to send their kids there, he told them he they they I guess they put in a note they didn't want the child to do this and this thing that he just looked at it tossed it away and told the kid you want a bed here's the wood okay wow. make your yeah. own bed he said I love that 
and then Booker and then at the same time Frederick Douglassson always said you want to help the white the black man don't because they know you give somebody something all the time just like a child right. they don't want to do you get some right earn your keep and don't you, you remember that phrase teach a man to fish yes. Is it, that, yes. right you teach him how to fish you don't That's give him a fish a fish okay because right. even Jesus said when they was up after he fed the 5,000 and then they come to the far and they want to hear he said no you came to me not because you wanted to hear what I have to say and just think because I fed you right so they want to get fed again right. for free don't you think it's time for a change I do I really think it's time for a change yeah. and this yeah. this guy Cuomo I remember his father his father was nothing right his, really Yes, I do agree. His father was nothing. And he's worse than his father. It, Talking about he doesn't want a conservative in this not welcome here. Well, look, I'm not Borg. You ever watch Star Trek? I don't, I don't. Oh, well, yeah. I saw Star Trek. Right. I am not a Borg. Right. Okay. okay? Now, a you Borg. go look at Tra Star Trek and find out what a Borg is. Yes. You know? They conform. I am not a Borg. I'm allowed to have my own mind. I'm allowed to be an individual. God made me an individual. He didn't make me a conglomerate. Okay? If I don't like your thinking, some people say, oh, all of us black people got to stick together. No, I said, no, I I'm not going to stick that. together with you. Because one, just like all black people don't look alike, I don't have to do what you're doing. I don't see a D stamped on your forehead. No, no, no. I teach, I teach my child the color is not a hindrance. You don't go out there and read a book and study like you're supposed to. Okay? Nobody owes you anything. I have to go okay? into the Apollo. So I Can I give both of you ladies a hug? Please yeah. do. I'll see you on Wednesday, right? <laughs> thanks for talking. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you. For more great videos, download the Walkaway Social app at walkawaysocial.com. Share your testimonial and join our community.